the odds are very high that in the first quarter of next year, we're going to have a big shakeout in all markets, equity markets and commodity markets. So prepare for that shakeout now. Get set as we start our journey into the world of global economics and potential financial turbulence. We are diving deep into the forecasts surrounding a possible global depression by 2025, guided by the insights of none other than Simon Hunt. Whether you are an investor or just keen to understand the landscape, prepare for insights that might reshape your perspective. I will try to keep it simple to explain everything. Chapter 1 Echoes of the Past Think back to tough times in the past. The 1930s brought the Great Depression, a huge financial disaster that hurt jobs and economies. It was a time of money problems. The stock markets crashed, businesses closed, and many people lost their jobs. This made a big impact that lasted a long time. Moving ahead a bit, let's remember 2008. That's when the world had another money crisis, the global financial crisis. You might remember how the housing market fell apart. This caused problems for banks and money systems everywhere. These times got us thinking about how money systems work. Simon Hunt, who is good at watching money trends, thinks there might be another big money problem, like a global depression, around 2025. He is an astute observer of economic trends. He has been piecing together clues that point towards the possibility of a global depression by 2025. However, let's not forget that history isn't a mere repetition of events. It's a complex dance between past and present. History doesn't just repeat itself, it's a mix of the past and the present. Chapter 2 – The Voice of Insight There is a world with economic foresight where a single voice can hold the potential to shape our understanding of the financial landscape. Over the years, Hunt's analyses have often proved prescient earning him credibility and recognition among his peers. Hunt's perspective on the potential for a global depression by 2025 stems from a meticulous analysis of various economic indicators. He has highlighted concerns about trade imbalances, mounting debt, and the fragility of global financial systems. Drawing parallels with historical economic downturns, Hunt has emphasized that the interconnectedness of economies today could magnify the impact of any impending crisis. One of Hunt's notable quotations encapsulates his perspective. Governments and central banks are going to come under pressure. It's going to be very, very difficult for them to contain a major recession. This statement underscores his belief that the global economy's challenges might stretch the limits of policy measures traditionally used to mitigate economic downturns. To go from the low in the stock markets in the first half of the year to the high in the stock markets at the end of the year and into mid-2025. So how do we get there? I think the markets have overbought the fact that the Fed is going to ease. I think that we will see 10-year treasuries moving up to 55 5.7% in the first quarter. Hunt's contributions extend beyond his insights alone. He has been a vocal participant in financial discourse through various mediums. Hunt's analyses offer a fresh take on economic matters, from sharing his perspectives in influential publications to engaging in discussions with industry insiders. His ability to challenge prevailing wisdom encourages a deeper understanding of the intricate dynamics that shape our financial world. His meticulous examination of economic variables and his ability to contextualize historical lessons make his insights a crucial part of the conversation. Chapter 3 – Unveiling Potential Scenarios Now we will explore potential scenarios that might play out on the stage of a global depression by 2025. Before you start picturing doomsday scenarios, Let's remember that we are here to peek into different storylines, not to predict the future with absolute certainty. So, imagine 2025 and the global economic landscape is shifting. Simon Hunt's warnings are echoing in our minds as we consider the factors at play. 
trade tensions, mounting debt, and technological disruptions have created a perfect storm. Economies are grappling with the aftermath of widespread financial turmoil. In one possible scenario, governments worldwide are grappling to keep their economies afloat. Stimulus packages have been rolled out, but the question remains, will they be enough to ward off a prolonged recession? Job losses are widespread, leading to social and political unrest as communities demand solutions. Not all scenarios need to be grim. In another storyline, innovative technologies and industries have emerged as beacons of hope. Renewable energy, artificial intelligence, and sustainable practices have taken center stage, fueling economic growth and job creation. Governments have embraced forward-looking policies that encourage resilience and adaptability. Before you start making bets on which scenario is more likely, let's remember that the future is a complex web of variables. Economic trends, political decisions, and unforeseen events are all part of the equation. And here's the thing. As much as Simon Hunt's insights can guide us, even he doesn't possess a crystal ball that reveals the future in its entirety. After all, the future is like a puzzle with missing pieces. We can try to imagine the picture, but we will never have the full picture until it unfolds. Chapter 4 – Unraveling the Threads Imagine a global chessboard where industries are like players making strategic moves. Simon Hunt's observations hint at the chess game of trade imbalances and shifts that might contribute to the economic tapestry. Trade relationships that once seemed stable are showing signs of strain. Countries are grappling with the balancing act of imports, exports, and currency values. Hunt emphasizes the significance of industries like technology, energy, and manufacturing. These sectors don't just churn out products, they shape economies and influence global dynamics. Technological innovations might be the silver lining, but they also disrupt traditional job markets, sparking debates about retraining, education, and economic adaptation. But here's the twist. As much as Hunt's insights offer a glimpse into the puzzle, they are not the entire picture. The interplay of industries and trade is as intricate as a spider's web, with connections and consequences that ripple across borders. Consider this as an example. Industries and trade are like the gears that keep the economic machine running. If one gear grinds to a halt, it can affect the entire mechanism. Hunt's perspective urges us to be mindful of these gears' movements, how they interlock, how global events influence them, and how they might contribute to the potential puzzle of a global depression. Remember that the world of industries, trade, and economic shifts is complex, and you can understand them with ease by using the insights that Simon Hunt is sharing. Because inflation will be, by certainly the early months of 2025, if not before, global inflation will be over 10%. Um, 10-year treasuries will be yielding probably closer to 13%, and that will be enough to uh, kill uh, the global economy, given how highly leveraged it is. This kind of data allows you to open up your mind and learn more about the latest trends and the changing environment of the current world. This is why you must be ready to adapt and respond to the ever-evolving chess game of industries and trade. Chapter 5 – Navigating the Impending Global Depression Now, let's roll up our sleeves and tackle the heavyweight topic at hand, the potential global depression that's been on the horizon. First off, let's acknowledge that a global depression isn't a one-size-fits-all scenario. It's like a hurricane that can impact different continents differently. Simon Hunt's insights offer us a compass, but we must tailor our strategies to our unique economic situations. Governments play a pivotal role here. They have got the steering wheel to navigate their economies through choppy waters. In response to a potential global depression, governments might adopt measures like fiscal stimulus, job creation initiatives, and policies that encourage innovation. Think of it as their way of putting on rain boots and grabbing an umbrella to weather the storm. Now, what can you do in this economic rainfall? Think of yourself as an economic gardener, tending to your financial garden during both sunny days and storms. Diversification becomes your tool, 
just like planting a variety of crops to ensure a bountiful harvest. Spread your investments across different assets, sectors, and even continents. This strategy can help buffer the impact if a specific area takes a hit. Education is another weapon in your arsenal. Just like learning survival skills before a camping trip, educate yourself about economic trends, potential risks, and opportunities. Stay informed about technological advancements, changing industries, and shifts in global dynamics. It's like equipping yourself with the knowledge to navigate through challenging terrains. Collaboration is key on a global scale. Think of it as different countries coming together to share resources during a crisis. International cooperation can help mitigate the effects of a potential global depression. Trade agreements, joint efforts in innovation, and coordinated policies can create a united front against economic challenges. Remember, while the shadows of a global depression might be looming, it's not all doom and gloom. Just as storms pass and give way to sunshine, economic downturns can also pave the way for recovery and growth. Our ability to adapt, innovate, and work together is the key. By staying informed, diversifying your strategies, and fostering collaboration, you are better equipped to brave the waves and find solid ground amidst the turmoil. Chapter 6 – Preparing for what's to come We have woven together history, insights from Simon Hunt, and a touch of economic imagination to paint a comprehensive picture. Remember that the future is a canvas painted with endless possibilities, waiting for our individual and collective strokes. Simon Hunt's guiding voice has led us through the labyrinth, offering perspectives that not only ignite contemplation, but also drive us to take purposeful action. The global economy is a complex tapestry of interconnected threads, each thread weaving its narrative and shaping the intricate landscape we navigate. Our journey has traversed industries, examined trade dynamics, scrutinized government responses, and underscored the vitality of collaboration. This odyssey of discovery has initiated conversations that ripple through the minds of individuals, policymakers, and economists alike. The notion of a potential global depression serves as a summons for vigilance and preparedness, not a clarion call for despair. Just as a skilled mariner readies their vessel for tumultuous waters, we must arm ourselves with knowledge, embrace diversification, and cultivate a nimble spirit of adaptability. Thus, remember, as we stand at this juncture of exploration, that while the path ahead may appear veiled in uncertainty, it is also teeming with the potential for innovation and growth. Whether you embody the role of an investor, a seeker of knowledge, or someone keen to decipher the world's intricacies, this information must have equipped you with fresh viewpoints and a set of tools to navigate the dynamic seas of economic transformation. As the horizon beckons, let us march onward, fueled by a blend of cautious optimism, unwavering hope, and a resolute commitment to confront whatever destiny unfurls before us. If this journey through the complexities of a potential global depression has piqued your interest, why keep it to yourself? Show some love by hitting that like button and sharing this video with others as well. But what's this? This journey has just begun, and there is a whole lot to be discovered by you. If you want more informative videos like this, you can watch them all on the channel. You can click here to watch the next amazing video that will surprise you. Simply subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to stay notified for every next upload.